Hello everybody, this is Peter Bodo from Tennis.com here back at the US Open with my good time long friend Nick Voluntary. Nick, today, Jack Sock gets a win. Florian Meyer of Germany retires in a third set with dizziness, but the first two sets, Jack looked very good. What did you think? Well, there's a reason why. He, he's a strong boy, he's got a big serve, big forehand, and I tell you what, he's quite confident. His dad has done a great job. I believe he'll be around for a long time. It's going to take a couple of years to win some of the big matches, but he has a great future. 19 years old too, so you know he's 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 got he's got some some time to go. He can, has, doesn't have to be in any hurry. Now another one, now another player who's worked with you, who was also a prodigy at one time, a little bit like Sock, but then ran into some real injury problems. Kay Nishikori seems to be really playing well again. He won a, he won today. Well, Kay Nishikori is what we call a shot maker, and I just spent last week with him at the academy. He's been there since he's been 13 years old. He has the capability to beat anybody on a given day if those injuries stay free. He's also a young guy. He creates shots. He's exciting to watch. Another alumni of the Nick Voltaire IMU Tennis Academy, Maria Sharapova. Today, pretty easy time of it. Uh, she's had a great year so far, completed a career at Garrison. What are you expecting of her here? Well, well, first of all, you know, the IMG Academy is proud of all the protégés that have come through there. Maria Sharapova is a unique individual. She stayed very quiet in the social life. She's all business, only a few people in a box. When she's healthy and able to serve well, she's fantastic. She plays the game one way. Hit it, I'm going to hit it harder. The quicker the points, the more it favors Maria Sharapova. Nick, other impressions of today, the first of the Open? It's a little too early for talk about matchups or anything like that. But what did you see today that struck you? Anything we should be looking for? Well, for, first of all, I'm looking towards tonight's matches. I, I believe it's going to be interesting to see how young Vicky Duval goes out there. She's been at the academy since she's been a young, young girl. Remember her daddy almost died in the Haiti right. uh, catastrophe. And she's now with the USDA with my blessing. It's going to be interesting because Kim Kleisters is, is going to end her career here. And Kim is not going to give her anything. She's a competitive, so that'll be interesting. Also. What's so interesting today, Peter, is the chatter around the whole place without Nadell being here. It's, it's a big boy. Now you're down to three. Murray looked good today. It's going to be an interesting open, Peter. And the whole thing is, if I were these top players, I wouldn't look past one round. Why? All the little rabbits, baby, want to become famous overnight and beat you. So that's the penalty of being the best in the world. you got to play better every single day. Well, and this is the place you got to do it to, the easiest place to make that big mark. This is Peter Voto for Tennis.com with Nick Voluntary. Make sure you come back and join us tomorrow.